Show me up. So won't you say my name? Say my name. 
words with your actions I need more than satisfaction Did you really feel that action? Really wanna give your all the place in front of your friends How that works, way that you're doing the most But we take a picture, get this one I bet you will be jabbed Me, I know get tired, I did that that I cover my face, calling me a bad job. We demand we do be a bad job. What's it going on? She was gone. All the better. They get them. Ride the boat. I know we die for nothing. What's it going on? She was gone. All the better. They get them. Ride the boat. I know we die for nothing. Make you know say anything when you do, they must come and date. I can't come and be my friend. So anything when they do, they try to do one this way. I can't come and be my friend. Plenty, 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 so I'll be my friend. Just to make your money date. But my people then go say, I don't want to buy. I don't want to die. I don't want to me. I want to enjoy. I want to have life. I want to buy a motor. I want to build a house. I still want to know. Let me tell you. What's it going? You are gone, all the Bentley, the Gallery, ride the boat, I know we die for nuts. What's it gone? She was gone, all the Bentley, the Gallery, ride the boat, I know we different things that happening, schemes and packaging. In our one night for shows, I'm juggling, rolling the ocean, my boat, I'm paddling. Shout out to fella, that's my bro, my family, frozen trains. When it comes to money, I take concentrate. Look at any streets, you are not my mate If you become a shame, I'll be here to stay But my people then go say, I don't want to buy I don't want to die, I don't want to I want to enjoy, I want to have life I want to buy a motor, I want to build house I still want to know What's it going on? You are gone, all the better Think I live, ride the boat I know we die for nothing
take it for a ride Let me take it off your mind Cause you know it's a season And I move, and I move, and I move when I ride And I move, and I move, and I move when I ride That's probably why your face is always breaking out. Right. You need to wash your hands before you wash your face. I don't care who you are or what you were doing, that if they're gonna touch your face without washing your hands, how do you expect your face to get clean? Because you're literally just rubbing dirt onto your face. So, yeah. Wash your hands before washing your face. Yes. Good morning. It's Friday, but before you know it, it's gonna be Monday again. So let's enjoy the weekend. Okay, I'm definitely gonna have to wash my face by the thing It makes a mess. So I'm gonna take a shower and I'll talk to you guys nice, nice. You know, then I'm gonna do another vlog where I don't talk to you guys. So I'm gonna take a shower and then I'll talk to you guys nice, nice. So, yeah, I don't even know if you can see me or not, but yeah.
Fighting me for my food. Take <laughs> your, your face is not gonna be in. <laughs> your face is not in the video. You want my hand? You are paying me. If you don't take, I'm not gonna give you. I'm bullying Julia into taking my cookies. Now I'll show your face. Hey, hey. So, guys. <laughs> now I use my cloud here. <laughs> yeah, me. So this is what I'm left with. I wish that I could be one of the girls that has it together always. I wish I wasn't afraid of the world. Been hiding in my bed for days. I don't wanna wake up. Don't wanna feel what I'm. Hello, buddy. Oh my goodness. <laughs> the last video I filmed, I didn't talk to you guys. And then I just filmed another video. And I was about to post this video. And I'm like, what the heck is a vlog without me talking to you guys? Like, does that even make sense? Like, I can't keep posting vlogs without me talking to you guys. I don't why i do not talk like i'm just not in a vibe of talking for some reason i was I, i've just not been in a vibe of talking but now i'm in a vibe of talking the only thing is that i'm currently in class so i'm attending an online class but i'm also um, cooking and i have laundry that i need to fold here let me show you y'all can see y'all can see yes so I have that laundry that I need to fold. So what I'm going to do is that while I'm in class, I'm just going to fold my laundry while the dinner cooks. So I'm cooking. <gasps> Bae's in town. <laughs> yeah. So my boyfriend is in town all week. He actually came last weekend. He came on Saturday, last week, Saturday. That's when he came and he's gonna be around until the end of the week so we are basically together all week long which is super exciting i don't think we've ever spent that much time together outside of holidays you know like december holidays that's the only time we've ever spent that much time together so it's actually new like you know waking up together good morning then morning kiss and then 
getting ready together to go to work and then coming back from work and then just being together it's kind of weird actually because we kind of have this routine where we call each other naturally like after work like we would call each other and be on the phone with each other or like if not after work then after my classes we'll call each other and be on the phone with each other so it's kind of weird now that i can't do that like he's here i have to talk to him in person and not over the phone so uh yeah kind of a little weird but like really fun and exciting and new and yeah i guess we needed this for our relationship or whatever so class is on break now that's why i'm talking but as soon as the lecturer comes back i will get back on on the class and then fold my laundry while i listen to what the lecturer is actually saying so yeah that's what we're gonna do now bay is not home right now i'm just gonna i don't know where he is actually but yeah he's not home Okay, bunny. So, okay, bunny. So, this is the only way I can trust this microphone. So, I'm holding this microphone this way by my mouth because it's the only way I trust it. The only way I can trust it. So, I'm done folding my laundry, but the class is still ongoing. Let me just show you. Yes, so class is still ongoing, but I'm done folding the laundry. So I'm just thinking of putting the laundry on the bed in the bedroom. Oh. I keep forgetting and letting go of the mic. But I was saying, <laughs> I'm not going to start this video all over again. Mm -mm. So <coughs> class is still ongoing. So I'm just thinking of putting away the laundry in the bedroom and then just going to cut the like the vegetables that have to go in the food that I'm cooking. So I don't want the clothes to end up smelling like food. So I'm just gonna take it out of here, put it in the bedroom and close the bedroom door. Um, Bay is still not here yet. And I'm just, yeah, gonna continue cooking. And then once I'm done cooking, I'm going to put away the laundry. And then once I'm done putting away the laundry, we're gonna have a quick moment here to just chit chat have a big girl chat so if you're not following me on instagram you should but i went on instagram today actually and i just randomly asked people have you ever went through your boyfriend's phone and if you did what did you find so i'll be reacting to those findings <laughs> and that's how we'll be closing off that video let me just show you what i'm cooking that really looks bad <laughs> Because it doesn't make sense right now, so it looks bad. But I'm making erki soup in there. That's what that is in there. And then we have chicken over there. And I just want to, the chicken to overcook and become like really soft. And then from there, I'm going to put it into the erki soup. So I'm basically just making a chicken and erki soup. Yeah, that's what I'm making for dinner. So I'll show you guys the end results once it's ready, of course. But for now, see you guys later. I that I could be one of the girls that has it together always. I wish I wasn't afraid of the world, then hiding in my bed for days. I don't want to wake up, don't want to feel what I'm feeling, just want to lay low. But baby, you made me hear it out. Am I enough for you? Don't want to let you down. You got a lot to lose, but you still stick around.
got it, crib, got it, job, on it, did I ever ask you to take me to go shopping in Paris or go sailing overseas and just drape me in Gucci, no, all I ever asked was you to pick up the phone when you alone, all I ever asked was you to show me some love, kisses and hugs, no, I never had an issue, go to the club with your boys, baby, I never wanted you to stay too long.
really want to stay. I don't really want to go. But I really need to know. Can we get it together? Oh, oh, oh. Get it together. Get it together. This is how you know you you are finally winding down, heading your would you cut it at home? <laughs> this is how you know Kusham. I'm gonna say this in a share but some things just sound better in a share and then I'll try to direct translate it. Me? Ah, this is how you know Kusham. Urikarira. Uringuri Ramu Maria when you need to home boy in Jui Kovirke. I've been a moon to make a shadow, some more of the Namu, Joe Washimon and Distovina, Mashawa Munya Distavina. Um, direct translating what I just say. I say, This is how you know that you work for yourself, you make money for yourself, and you reward yourself with some. Um, Cocoa, cocoa and, and, and marshmallow. You have no one to tell you that you are wasting food. If you are coming from a black household, you know what I mean. Yeah. Anyways, um, I really hope there's no echo. I've never filmed in this scene before, so I don't know how it's gonna go. But it's finally the moment that y'all have been waiting for. I'm going to be reacting to what you guys say on the gram. <laughs> what were your responses? So I'm just going to read through the responses and, and read and react to them. Y'all kind of... Y'all did a thing. I read some already, but I still have others that I, I didn't read. But I read some already. So... Let's see. I'm gonna open the one that I didn't read yet. So the uh, reminder, the question I asked was, um, let me go on Instagram and just go back and, and confirm. And if you guys are not following me on Instagram, like, what are you waiting for? Why are you not following me on Instagram? It said, Honey Rukoro, please go ahead and follow me on Instagram. That's the worst thing that you found in your boyfriend's book. So I am not here to say it's okay to go into your boyfriend's phone. I mean, when you enter into someone's phone, you get what you find. Okay, that's my stance. Like, if you want to break up with me, just go ahead and break up with me. Don't go through my phone and vice versa. Like, if I want to break up with you, I'll just break up with you. I won't go through your phone. But, like, sometimes we are human, okay? So, sometimes we do end up finding ourselves going through the phone. And sometimes it literally has nothing to do with the other person, but everything to do with yourself so um your insecurities or and then which are things that you can also just communicate to the person about so like you don't have to go through their phone to find out these things but like sometimes we just want to we just we just want to find out we just want to hate ourselves and yeah we need a reason sometimes we want to break up with you but we have no reason to break up with you so we're just going to go through your phones and then sometimes really it's just us it's just me maybe i'm even the one cheating in I'm trying to make myself feel better about my cheating. Yes, that's one thing. And so you go through the other person's phone hoping they're going to find something about them cheating as well. So it's not you alone doing it. But yeah, those are just some of the reasons why somebody would probably do that. But like, in all honesty, if you're ready to leave the relationship, just leave the relationship. You don't have to go through his phone to confirm yourself, um, to confirm your reason for wanting to leave the relationship. Just leave, okay? Now, if you know that you're not going to leave regardless of whether you found out he's cheating or not why torture yourself don't go through his phone okay no we're not doing that here so let's go hear what the people had to say this one is like <laughs> okay so what's the worst thing you found this person responded the different photos of me and call girlfriend's nudes <gasps> that gender name <laughs> Nara, if you go and make a whole folder, like why are we making folders? And if you're gonna make folders, at least give us names, you know? Make different folders for all of us. We can't just put us all in one folder, like, huh? -uh, why are we all in one folder? Make it make sense. It, it, it ain't making sense. Don't put us in one folder. Mm -mm. 
Mm-mm. Mm-mm. <laughs> oh wow, well, some one just came in as I'm reading this one. So let's read them. Guys, you people on Instagram don't like following rules. Now somebody is asking me who do you text the most? Um my boyfriend. That's the person I text the most, honestly speaking. My boyfriend. Yeah. <laughs> That's the person I text the most. Next one, um <gasps> what was the worst thing you found? Eight other girlfriends and there was a phrase he used for me that I really loved. Kandi he used it for all of us. Imagine I thought him asking if I ate. He was being caring. Kandi he was asking everyone the same question. <laughs> Yeah, ne. Ah, no man, no. Let's keep pet names just specific to a person. Like, ah, uh-uh, ah, no. We c- you can't all be calling us the same pet name. But then again, if you think about it, calling us all the same pet name is smart, ne? Because then, like, you are not accidentally going to call the wrong person the wrong name. Men are becoming smarter with their cheating. <laughs> mm. Next one is. Sexy chats with a well-known old lady who's married in prominent church figure. <gasps> cool. I love the fact that y'all are laughing at these things. Like, <laughs> just imagine getting into your boyfriend's phone and then finding your whole this whole lady from church. Eh? And she's even old. And ah, she no. Ah, uh-uh. you are crossing boundaries. Eh, eh. Some boundaries you must not cross like that. Church lady, wow, uh uh, eh. Hmm. Next one, the first trip, the first trip his baby mama sends him. Oh, the first traps his baby mama sends him, and how he continuously turns her down, which is a good thing because before that I was so insecure. Oh, you got like it, oh, you got like But like, <laughs> oh, let me just give you a tip, me. Like, just say the number. Like, okay, maybe you know. Maybe you know. Let me not give people bad advice here. But like, I had a similar situation where the person was clearly turning the person down, and then I saved the number because I was just like, mm 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 mm, this this. I saved the number, and then one day. I decided to go through his messages and there were <laughs> there were messages that were suggesting otherwise that were not him turning her down anymore and yeah it didn't turn out so well for me and because I saved the number I just took the number and put it in my number my phone and I'm like oh is that crazy number that I saved <laughs> so yeah story for another day but yeah same. Maybe you just got lucky this time, or maybe really he's really just honest and loyal like that. But yeah. Next one. Found them sending P videos to one another, telling each other that's how they gonna do each other when they meet. He threw his phone in front of me, and the phone screen broke beyond repair. Luckily, already sent the evidence to my phone, and also. <clears throat> Pictures of the home girl he was chatting to. <laughs> Let's break this down. You found. Wait, what? You found P videos like. <laughs> the whole shebang was just there. And the fact that he. I mean, I guess he lost his phone. I wonder what phone it was. Was it an expensive or a cheap phone? And then, girl, why are you sending the nudes to yourself like what are you gonna do with them okay i understand the the, the, the evidence like you need the evidence right but like of the home girl like <laughs> just keep the evidence of your home boy bro you don't have a, 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 an agreement with the home girl maybe hey, home girl they didn't even know that you were existing but i i hope you didn't share them sure. not judging but oof i is a lot Next one, text messages with a broken heart. Yeah, you, you went looking, you find what you were looking for. I tried 
so many times, but to be honest, I never found anything since we started dating. Whoa, girl. Stop going through his phone. Okay, stop going through his phone. For me. This person. Found an album of him and another girl. Mesha, photos and videos of them kissing and whatnot. Nyane! <laughs> it's not easy on these streets. Oh, I'm just y'all are leaving me hanging, man. Nobody is saying you left the guy, what you did. I guess I didn't go into details like that, but y'all are leaving me hanging. I don't know what's going on here. Ooh. This person found another girl's nose. Maramin. Guys, I shit, that's one thing I'm not doing. I don't care how much I love you, but I'm not sending you a nude that people can look at and say, oh god, well, that's honey. Ha, it's not happening. Ooh. Somebody responded, can we be besties? Well, just slide into my DM and ask me if we can be besties. Like, I already have a bestie, so maybe we can't be besties, but we can be friends. That's for sure. Wouldn't feel to have an extra friend. But like, how am I gonna know now if you're coming through NGL? Like, it's anonymous. I don't know who you are. So just slide into the DM and we can be friends. Next. Zero, ooh, zero talk with girls. That's when I realized the man was actually obsessed with me, even asking his best friend for money to take me out. Oh, <laughs> that's so sweet. Yeah, it ended up in him isolating me from my friends and family. Okay, until that happened, <laughs> it was sweet until that happened. Essentially, abuse. I'll never recommend dating obsessive guys. Yeah, no, mm -mm. something I believe in is that, um. Find a man that's already in love with you and obsessed with you and wants to be with you and learn to love him. Maybe you don't necessarily love him in the beginning of the relationship. So start it off as a friendship, eventually learn to love him. Then the other way around where you are the one obsessed with the man, like, yeah, no, mm -mm. And going after no man that is not into me. Like if you're not coming to me and you're not showing interest in me and you are not you know, trying to get with me. Um, I'm not gonna try to get with you. Like, mm -mm. you're gonna love me before I love you. Okay, y'all. So those are the entries that y'all sent through. Yeah. Um, I wanna have this type of you know sister, big sister chats at the end of my vlogs. So um, if you guys like the style of big sister chats that I just been from at the end of a normal daily vlog or weekly vlog or whatever vlog like that. Let me know and I'll make more of them. But yeah, I just enjoy having big sister talks with y'all. They're just so fun and I don't know. I just love talking about relationships. I know I said I'm gonna start a podcast. I'm still working on it. Like I was so ready, but then oh, guys, I can't find any Bluetooth mics. Like I can't find proper microphones and I'm not about to start a, a podcast without a proper microphone. Like it's just not happening. Okay, so um yeah no everything is ready i have a setup and everything i just i'm looking for a microphone and i can't find a microphone so if you know good microphones in namibia now there are a lot of good microphones but i just have to i guess get through amazon prime and all of those things but like i'm not willing to take those risks like mm -mm, it's a lot of money and i'm not willing to risk it like that so unfortunately for me i do not have a microphone so if you know a good place where i can get a good podcast microphone that's at a good and affordable price and i'm with you please leave a comment in the comment section down below any holes i hope you all enjoyed this vlog like i was literally gonna scratch out the beginning of this vlog but i was just like you know what that was good content i'm not gonna get i'm not gonna do that so Decided not to get rid of the videos and decided to make like a whole vlog and then just included this at the end of the vlog. So I really hope y'all enjoyed the video and y'all are gonna leave a comment in the comment section down below. It's free of charge but it means the world to me so I um, would really 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 appreciate it if y'all did that for me. So um, I'll see you guys in the next vloggy vlog. Uh, I'll see you guys in the next vloggy vlog. <laughs> Y'all can see I don't know how to dance, right? So, bye!